Hey y'all, it's Dr. Know-It-All coming to you on a rather wet Christmas day. I want to talk about what is regenerative braking. So first of all, what is a motor? A motor is relatively simple, and remember the engineering details are very complex, but I'm just going to do a very, very basic idea here. The idea is that you have a couple of bar magnets around the outside that are stationary, or they're called stators, and then inside of that you have a coil of wire that is wrapped up. And what you do is you apply voltage to it via a battery, or you could do it with alternating current, but like I I said today it's super simple we're going to do it with a battery and brushed motors and everything and when you put an electric current through a wire you get a magnetic field out of that wire and that magnetic field reacts against the stator's magnetic field and the rotor turns in the middle you put a couple of wheels on the end of it or something like that and all of a sudden you have an rc car or you have a tesla model 3 or a vacuum cleaner or whatever else you want to drive with this electric motor so how do you regenerate what is regenerative braking what is regeneration well that's exactly the opposite so so imagine you've got your Model 3 driving down the road and the wheels are turning and so therefore the rotor in the middle with all of those coils of wire is turning and turning and turning. Well what you can do is you can plug that into the battery again but this time when the coil is turning through that magnetic field, that magnetic field and the coil react and generate an electric current. That electric current then drives electrons back into the battery and recharges the battery. And it's really that simple. Pretty much any electric motor can be a generator and regenerative braking is simply plugging the system back into the battery when you're not actually driving it with an electric current, but using the fact that that rotor is already spinning because you're in motion to push electrons back into the battery. All right, I hope that was helpful. If it was helpful, let me know in the comments because I am happy to do a bunch of short videos explaining basic things like this. Let me know if you have any other questions and I'll be happy to answer those too. In the meantime, I'll see you in the next one. Bye-bye.